And now, CBS 4 Sports with Clay Williams. Time to look at the polls in volleyball. Texas Girls Coaches Association says Mack High, McAllen Row, and McAllen Memorial are still all three ranked in Class 6A, while in Class 5A they've got Mission Veterans Donna and Ed Calchelsa coming in new. Meanwhile, Texas High School Coaches Association Region 4 football polls look like this, with Port Isabel up a notch, Raymondville and Rio Hondo in the 4A Division 2. In 5A, Ed, uh, Edinburgh Vela moves up two spots to number 8, whereas in 6A it's one spot down for McAllen Memorial and one spot up for San Benito. Donna, one of the 17 Valley teams that took their bye in week four, and the Redskins went into that bye on the heels of a one point win over Hannah on a Thursday. This week, it's a Thursday game for the Redskins again. And when Donna travels to far to take on PSJ Southwest, they will be fully healthy. That includes star running back Paul Guerra, fully recovered from his back injury. Coach Leal knows he'll need all hands on deck to start 32 5A play against the Javelinas. I think, you know, we don't want to be where it's just a, a two-headed monster or three-headed monster. We want everybody to be part of the team as far as, you know, getting everybody involved. That way we don't focus and be multi, multi-dimensional. Hey, so now we have another person throw in the mix, and we just want to spread around as best we possibly can. That's awesome. Give a whole week of just rest. That's awesome. Get these guys back here on the field, ready to go. Week one, district. Let's get that W. A week ago, after suffering a hairline fracture in his hand versus Edinburgh North, it was thought Ed couch quarterback Marco Aguinaga would be out two to three weeks. Today, though, the prognosis changes. The surgery required will keep the Jackets junior sidelined at least six weeks, earliest return the last week of the season.